our day school here at the Presbyterian Church, the Presbyterian Day School, is the envy of the world. Yes, I have said it. And it is because Robin Moore, our director, has been here 16 years and has poured her heart and soul into it. Um, how many of y'all had kids or family members that went to the Presbyterian Day School? A bunch of you? Yes. Uh, and many in the community have. Um, I've, I've been in several churches, and when the day school doesn't go well, it's a nightmare and a disaster. And that has not been the case in the past 16 years, nor will it be moving forward. But we're taking this time to say thank you to Robin for all that she has meant to our church family, to the families in Columbus, our military families, um, many, many of whom make up uh, portions of our demographics for the day school. So uh, I would like to ask Robin to please come up so we can say thank you. She asked if she could lead all of worship and preach today, but I said no. <laughs> Just come and stand and smile. Um, and just for your knowledge, the day school is not a separate entity from the church. It is a part of our church and a part of our ministry. So we are closely um, related and we are all a part of one functioning body here at the church. So thank you, Robin. Um, we are sad to see you go, but excited for your next chapter. And we thank you so much for all that you have done for so many you think of all the kids from, we start at birth here um, and went up to a time, the lower uh, elementary school grades and then through fifth. through fifth, yeah. For a little while, then COVID shot that part. But we are back and thriving. And when you think of all the families that you and your teachers and those who have served uh, on the board and those who have helped and staff and church family, um, it really is something to treasure. And on behalf of everybody, I can't thank you enough. So thank you. As is our obnoxious custom, I will read a resolution of appreciation for Robin. Whereas 16 years ago, Robin Moore became the director of the First Presbyterian Day School following only two days of on-the-job training from her predecessor, Annalise Hyde, whose husband had received his military orders and family was departing for Korea. And whereas... Although Robin hails from New Jersey, she has, for the most part, come to claim the South as her home. Okay, all right, we'll go with it. And is now an avid Auburn fan, that I know, to the point of frequently donning the blue and orange, decorating her office with pictures of Jordan Hare stating, shouting, War Eagle, every time football is mentioned, and sporting an Auburn tiger tail even on her car, during every football season, and whereas Robin is known for being an exceptionally well-organized, hardworking, and highly structured individual who introduced the Montessori curriculum to First Presbyterian in 2011, making this the only day school in Columbus that offers Montessori training, which is a huge reason that uh, the school continues to grow and be healthy, and whereas during her tenure with the day school, Robin has been blessed to see two of her grandchildren start in the infant room and graduate from the kindergarten program with Aiden, a rising junior in high school, and Thomas starting first grade in the fall. And whereas Robin's ability to deal with adversity was obvious, but often challenged on some occasions by the church, such as called by the spirit renovation project, when for many months on a road, I heard a groan. Did you hear her groan? I heard it. On a rotating basis, either the reception hall, the gym, the porter cachet, and many classrooms were completely closed for construction and workarounds had to be devised. Or when the chapel area was rented out for our homes for good and all the day school offices were moved to the second floor, or again in March 2020, decision made to close down for a two-week period due to the virus, and the school did not open again until August 9th. 
after COVID-19 caused a drop in enrollment, created a need to replace 50% of the teachers, and whereas, Robin, with the assistance of LaToya Rembert. Let's give LaToya a hand as well. We love and appreciate LaToya. Great teachers and supportive parents has made First Presbyterian Day School one of the finest preschools in the area, and we wish for her all the best as she moves to Opelika and begins new ventures closer to her family. Now, therefore be it resolved that today, May 26, 2024, the Congregation of First Presbyterian Church of Columbus, Georgia, expresses our deepest appreciation and gratitude to Robin Moore for a job well done. Thank you so much. Oh, oh, look, they're standing. Thank you. And so we have a few gifts. Um, the first one is the magical resolution uh, that was just read. And thank you for Suzanne, who is the author of many, if not all of these. Um, that is framed for you to share with family and friends. And as a part of the day school family, um, this picture um, that includes all of the children, all of the teachers, the church staff as well, everybody here will have it for you to see outside afterwards if you want to take a look at it. But just uh, a way to remind her of the program that she has built and been a part of and uh, to remember of all those who love her here. Um, if you're wondering what this pot of random plantage is over here, it is not that. It is a part of the magnolia tree from out front that we had potted uh, for her to take with her since that's such a part of the coming and goings of every day school, we stare at that tree all day when, when the kids are coming and going, pick up and drop off, a part of this church um, that you can take with you and, and plant in your home and always remember us. We also have cards from a card shower that we will give to you also. And if you haven't had a chance to give a card of thanksgiving to Robin, uh, you can continue to turn that into us at the office. She's going to Opelika and we know how to find that. Uh, place and get her back here. So uh, please continue to offer your words of thanks and gratitude um, if you hadn't had a chance already. So Robin will be with us out on the front steps after worship. So again, we thank you. God bless you and we wish you the best. You can take them with you.